Hello guys, let me introduce you to the electrical engineering Medesia that runs on the TI Inspire handheld CX-CAS. So it takes a CAS calculator. CX alone will not do it. Number two, this app is massive. It contains anything that you need to know for an electrical engineering or any other electrical class. So look, ex for example, under tab one, under electricity, we have all the common electrical formulas, including Coulomb's law, and also um, electric field, voltage, anything that pertains to electricity. Induction, of course, we, can, we cover for you. Magnetism, with a bunch of magnetism formulas here for you. Circuits and laws, the standard uh, circuit and laws formulas, resistors in series or parallel, capacitators we have here for you, and of course the Kirchhoff laws as well. Um, energy and thermodynamics is uh, contained in this app as well. So you can do uh, conduction, convection, radiation, heat, dissipated energy, etc., etc. Lots of transforms, a lot of different Laplace transforms that, in, that involve, for example, unit steps or Dirac delta, del, Dirac delta, the, of course, inverse Laplace, inverse Laplace using Laplace, I mean, using partial fractions, a bunch of Fourier transforms, and of course, also table of Z transforms convolution inter integrals, and of course, also Fourier series. So you can see this uh, alone for, for all the transforms is very, very helpful. Of course, we have uh, vectors here, anything that pertains to vectors, simple vector computations, cross product, gradients, etc. But also, uh, of course, also integrals involving vectors, vector integrals, Green's theorem, surface integrals of vector fields, etc. Uh, conversions and number systems. So if you will need to convert um, base 10, 2 or 16, or actually any base to base 10 converter can be done right here. And the periodic system is here that you where you can um, look up any information about chemical um, elements any useful constants, um, absolute and percent error computations. Specific heats are here, and you can see and understand now why this app is loaded. So let me give you a quick run through Coulomb's law, for example, is listed here for you. Say you know everything except for F, so you can put in uh, your other quantities, they get plugged in and you get the final answer for F, the force, right here. If you change the 7 to an 8, you immediately get the correct uh, change answer for F. And this is how it goes for electricity, for induction, mag magnetism, circuits and laws. Okay, let's do a resistor in parallel, for example. So, say we have a total current of 20, that would be I, okay, or 22, and we now, uh, two other quantities are 10 and 8, so we can figure out that I n is just 22 minus the sum of 10 and 18. And of course, you could add more quantities right here and they all get subtracted from 20. Well, that's a little bit too much. So here those quantities get subtracted from 22 to get to end up at four. And that's how it goes. Circuits and laws, we just did. Energy and thermodynamics um, can be done the same fashion. Let me show you some transforms, Laplace transforms. Say you want to transform sine of T then sine of t is plugged into the Laplace integral. And then when the bounds 0 and infinity are applied, 
you end up with that Laplace transform right here. Say it's not sine of t, but sine of 3t, immediately you're going to get a similar answer, 3 over s squared plus 9. So you just change the initial input, and the output changes immediately. So it's pretty easy to use this app, and yet it's very powerful. Let's do, for example, for vectors, a simple cross product. You enter two three-dimensional vectors, and you figure out the cross product as the third, um, as another th three-dimensional vector that is perpendicular to those two, which is negative 4, negative 13, and 5. Change any of the original vectors, immediately your answer changes. As simple as that. Let's do some number conversion. Say you're given a decimal number like 56 in binary would be that number, and hexadecimal would be 38. Okay, let's do something familiar. Let's say 17. 17 in decimal would give us 10,001 in binary and in 11 in hexadecimal. Those are the three common number systems, but when you look carefully, you can actually convert any base to base 10 right here. And in extras, you can solve any 2 by 2 system of equations, periodic tables. Look at this. You want to look up helium. You type in HE. And anything pertaining to helium, like the atomic number, the metal group, etc., family, is listed right here.